السلام علیکم ویلکم سکس کلاس ان دا لسانین ورچول کلاسز آف سیکنڈ سیمسٹر آئی ایم ہوپ فل یو آر آل فائن اینڈ ڈوئنگ ویل آئی ایم یور انگلش ٹیچر اینڈ ہیئر از اے ورکنگ آف ڈیز سیونتھ اینڈ ایٹ سو لیٹ اسٹارٹ دا ورکنگ دا وائٹ ماؤس سرکس دس ایکسٹریکٹ از فرام رونالڈ ڈلس بک دا وچ از دا اسٹوریز اباؤٹ اے یگ بوائے اینڈ ہیز انکاؤنٹر ود وچ از The boy who lives with his grandmother, grandmother means Dadi and Nani, which is Minchurel, is due to spend his holidays in Norway. Spend means Uzarna holidays, chutiyan, but because his grandmother falls ill, ill means bimar hona. They cannot go. Instead, he is taken to a seaside hotel in England. If you have not read the book already, be sure to about soon it. Rooms were booked for us in a place. Place means jaga. Rooms means kamre. Call the hotel. Magnificent in the famous seaside. Magnificent. Umda ya shandar. Famous mashur seaside. Samandar ka kanara. Town. Town means kasba of Bournemouth. Bournemouth, my grandmother told me, was full of old people like herself. Old people means purani log. They retired uh, there by the thousand because the air was... so bracing and healthy it kept them so they believed believe means yakeen karna ya aitmad alive for a few extra years years means saal does it i asked maine usse pucha aisa ho sakta hai of course not yakeenan nahi she said usne kaha it's stormy road but just for once i think we have got to obey the doctor obey means pair bhi karna doctor means doctor Now come to the words meanings. First is famous, mashur, enormous, बहुत उम्दा या गैर मामूली terrific, बेहतरीन उम्दा trick, चाल unpleasant, ना खुशगवार compromise, समझौता करना business, कारोबार splendid, शानदार expert, माहिर string, रस्सी या डोरी ambition, इरादा या आरजू पा पंजा audience, सामाइन balance, तोजन and the last is climb, चढ़ना Here's the first question. What reason did the grandmother give for her going to Bournemouth? The grandmother decided to go Bournemouth in order to obey her doctor's orders. How do the boy describe the hotel? It was an enormous white building on the sea front. He described the hotel as the ground floor of the hotel was a maze of public rooms, all of them named in gold letters on the doors. Why did uh, the grandmother give the boy a pair of white mice? The grandmother had given the given the boy a pair of white mice as consolation because Bournemouth was a boring place. The next one is what was the first trick the boy taught the mice? The first trick the boy taught the white mice was to creep up the sleeve of his jacket and come out by his neck. Why did the hotel manager get angry with the boy and his grandmother? The hotel manager was angry with the boy and his grandmother for suggesting that the hotel was full of rats. Here's the next question: What made the boy confident that he had found a good place to train his mice? The boy was confident that he had found a good place to train his mice because. The ballroom was large and empty. The room had been used for a meeting of the members of the RSPCC, and even if these members were to come into the rooms while he was there, they would be good, kind, and people. The next one is: In what ways was the grandmother a clever and thoughtful lady? The grandmother outwitted the hotel manager by suggesting that there were rats in the hotel and it. and it might be closed down if this fact was reported to the public health authority so dear students that's all about my today's working thank you assalamu alaikum